Hello, this is Matthew Marco with AdmiralMapping.com, and welcome back to Final Fantasy XIII-2. We are finally ready to continue on with the actual story of this game as we go to the Sunlight Waterscape in 300 AF. Even as upheavals transform the world of man, nature tirelessly weaves her tapestry. Is that the snow? The Waterscape survives amidst the decaying cities of Cocoon. This was once a protected wilderness zone, and even without the Is that what his hair's always looked like? The landscape flourishes. Oh my Yet god. The teeming growth, the seeds of destruction are being quietly sown. He's even dumber than he was before. Alright, let's do this. I'm very excited. At some point, we're going to need to go back to prior histories and collect these fragments and stuff. I feel like that's where we'll find all the things we need to progress in the tower and maybe unlock some more of those gates. But... A twist of the knife. The joy is ephemeral. It leaves fear in its wake. A fear that all too soon the time will come when you must bid farewell again. Yet you cannot help but long for the next encounter. Humanity's great frailty. We prefer past happiness to future uncertainty. Oh, look at those little guys. They're so cute! So this is what the end of the world looks like. Are they going to destroy the planet? I don't know. But if the world does end here, my future should never have happened. Which means there must be a way to stop them. Audio balance. So, what is it? What's wrong? The daughters of the Cinder Cocoon are sacrificed to beasts of time itself. The pillar crumbles to ash and sand and down to earth. The cocoon does fall. What? What? Sarah. Sarah! Sarah! No! Wait! Sarah! What's wrong? What did she see? Was it a vision? Does Sarah have the same power as you? Okay, we're just this guy. We don't have any, uh... Mog's not with us even, so... Let's just head on forward. But why? Why did she react the way she did? Where did she go, even? I literally do not... Oh, this way. Let's go get her before we do anything else. Wow. That is one gigantic monster. Oh, hey, look. Oh, Jesus. I saw it. It's in the background. It's huge. Snow, is that really you? I, I can't believe it. What are you doing 300 years in the future, Snow? Sarah, am I dreaming again? You dream or not, you gotta get out of here. No, he's useful. Sarah watching? I don't think so. Fine, we'll do it together. Oh, we should probably uh switch to medic. Get everyone boosted up before we do anything. Huh. 
Bale? Who choose Bale? Oh, that's the staggered one, I think. For vigilance? Hmm. I don't remember what any of these do. Oh, Shogo. We have Shogo. Awesome. Let's go to town. Yeah, the uh, audio balance in this part of the game is just garbage. Just hot garbage. Wait, did we lose all our boosts already? It must have a thing that takes, it, takes them away. Because that's just nonsense. Get close, I'll cover you. Don't be a fool. Ah, trust me. We can't attack the other things, can we? No. They're just gonna keep healing, so this is just gonna become a war of attrition. That's fine, just keep us cured. Not afraid of some uh some poison. It's not gonna be the end of the world. We're actually doing alright, so I'm not gonna boost bump uh go and bump us up again. I'm mostly just gonna are we playing as Noel? Yeah, we are. Uh, nobody wants to play as Noel. It doesn't really matter. We just hit auto attack. But for some reason, I'm super offended at the idea of playing as Noel. I mean, not for some reason. Because Noel sucks. That's why. Let's not pretend. We got him. That was pretty cool. I'm not even gonna pretend it wasn't. I'm a fan. Just won't stay dead. Let's go. Give it up. Hit it hard while it's down. And I mean, we get out of here. Look, that way. Let's go. Listen, hotheads who can't back down don't last long on this planet. <laughs> Maybe. But sometimes you gotta make a stand. <sighs> You're not listening to me. Humans aren't strong. You got tan. They die easy. Well, some of us are tougher than others. <laughs> that hair, though, is anyway, the worst. Thanks for the help. You got a name? Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, this is Noel. And this is Snow. We're getting married. It's on hold for now. Uh, yeah. You know, somehow I didn't expect you to be such a hothead. All I hear is what a great guy Snow is. And look where you are, all the way in the future. I'm sorry, who's the hothead? What were you thinking bringing Sarah out here? Listen, Snow. Guess what, Lightning? I 
found snow again. I explain the plot. Still as reckless as ever, still doing his own thing. Oh, you mean he still sucks? I think I spent all that time worrying about him. Stupid me. Guess I'll never learn. And that's how we got here. Koopa. Now it's your turn. Why did you up and leave Sarah? What are you doing fighting here in the future? <sighs> you really want to know? <laughs> I asked, didn't I? Lightning appeared in my dreams, too. Can you believe it? You saw lightning? She told me I had to protect Cocoon, so I started jumping through time, checking things out. I learned that the giant jelly bean back there knocks Cocoon down. You mean the flan we just fought? Uh-huh. According to the stories I heard back in my own time, Cocoon was brought down by war. Well, there's more than just one cause. Did you see what it was doing, that flan? It's melting the crystal of the pillar, bit by bit. But Vanille and Fang, they're inside it. Yeah, so Cocoon starts to get unstable. People feel the tremors and begin to panic. Next thing you know, everyone's fighting each other. It's consistent with what I know, sort of. I can't believe lightning appeared in your dreams as well. She told you to protect Cocoon's pillar. So she must want you to save Vanille and Fang. Like I said, sometimes you gotta make a stand. I don't have a choice. My mission is to stop that thing for good. Hmm. Let's ask about Vanille and Fang. So will I. There's no telling how many people will die if Cocoon falls. None of this makes sense. There are thousands of flan appearing out of nowhere, and they're fusing and creating a beast that shouldn't exist. Could it be a paradox? If it is, we'll need to do some traveling to fix it. Which means you've got to find an artifact first. Lightning. Did you meet Snow in his dreams? Is there a reason why you can only talk to us when we sleep? Snow hasn't changed one bit, even though it's been years since I last saw him. He's still as hot-headed as the day we said goodbye. It makes me so mad. Maybe you shouldn't marry him then, he's a jerk. I've been caught up in the fate of the world for so long. It feels good to worry about the simple stuff. Being with Snow helped me forget about what the future might hold. <laughs> Can I switch leaders, please? Yes. Thank you. Go this way. Is this the way we came in? <laughs> No good. It we need to find the right. Right, right, right. Fine. I just want to sense the space. This is a map of the area. Take it with you. Oh, thanks. Uh, map is on square, right? Right. Yeah, that's at least the pawn. Let's not fight him. Oh well, that went poorly. Oh, we have snow with us. Cool. That's gonna make this really easy. I assume he's a commando? That looks like a commando move. He's really weak. I think we should have come here first, probably. Maybe not. Oh, boy. We're getting wrecked. Some cures would be great right now, thanks. 
Let's not go fight the Flown. Let's go this way instead. I might be able to get us around it. There's so many little flans. Where are they all going to? We follow them straight to the artifact. Oh, maybe. Can we fight the baby Flown? It may be drawn by the space-time disturbance. Let's find out. You know, I was telling, uh podcast co-host Jack said that this game is literally just oh, anime Doctor Who. Must be that fine. And it really is just Doctor Who. Not even a little bit. Okay. Okay, there's one of those. We don't really... We don't have our artifact, so it doesn't really matter, does it? Let's just go down. Um... Look at these guys. I wonder where they're going. This way first. Oh, it's Chocolina. Hello. Do you have any goodies for me? They're slimy and gooey and sticky and hey there. I'll sell you some great stuff, so in return, I... Yeah, you want me to kill the flan? That's fine. I'm not gonna do it right now, but I will get around to it. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you! And don't forget to take care of the flan. You promise? Right, I know. Um, do I have any new? I don't. God, I want a new Ravager. Oh, this is still blocked off. What's up? Oh! Right. So, no, you haven't told me why you're traveling through time. Long story short, I'm trying to save humanity. Save humanity? Why? What happens to us? I lived at the end of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all going bad. I've seen that cutscene. Hey, this is where the flan we're trying to get to. And there's our artifact. <laughs> Wait, did you not let me attack? Fine. These guys are cute. I want one of these guys on my team. for me this is crystal too huh. I've seen crystals like this before right sir you remember don't you I remember I cried a crystal tear yeah Sarah you know what it's like don't you being turned into crystal yes I know it was the loneliest, scariest moment of my life. Sarah, I... <laughs> it's alright. You know, I think I dreamed the whole time. But they were good dreams. Dreams about turning back to normal. Being with my friends again. Bubble? 
hope that's true. I hope Fang and Vanille are dreaming right now. I hope they're happy in there. Um... You think they can hear us in there? What if you sang them a song to let them know you're here? <laughs> yeah, better not. Oh. You can hear me singing. We just end up giving them nightmares. Trust me. I wanted a song. I wanted a song so bad. I'll take this. A blue flower. He's not wrong. Snow sucks. You're not getting any arguments from me about that. Maybe we should switch to Commando for a while, just until we get a Ravager worth a damn. This is like, just embarrassing. Yeah, doing 7 damage to like 400, it's just not okay. Just use the plan work for a while. I just don't know what else to do. There's no way up. There's the other crystal. Do I need I need the mall grab, don't I? Oh god damn. Oh well. At least we know where it is. Let's get the hell out of here. We need to go up. I'm not interested in using a chocobo. We could use the fighting. There's a treasure down here, it looked like. Right? Yep. It's a decent amount of gill for this game. This is a low gill game. Seemingly. I guess they all are these days, aren't they? Looks like this gate leads back to the Story of Crux. Yes, I know. We went that way. End of the road. We have to turn back. <sighs> oh, no, no, no. We don't want to fight that guy at all. Come on. No way we can take that. <laughs> hey! Like his buddy. It's his buddy. I don't think it hurt you. No answer. I guess I'll take that as a yes. It'll swallow you whole. <laughs> well, let's find what out. Is <laughs> <laughs> uh, bouncy. Is it I think so. I think he actually likes it. I just had an itch that needed scratching. Come aboard. Help me out. Hey. We got our thing, but yeah, let's take let's take a ride on the giant beast. Why not? This video might end up being a little longer. If that's the case, I'll split it into two parts like I did before. Because I assume we're around a half hour. I don't actually know. Can you check that out over there? No, it's too far for me, Google. Okay, I'll throw you closer. Good idea. We can broaden our search radius. Oh, we have Mog Throw now.
Oh, well, this makes life so much easier. No, 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 we need that, we need that! sucks but so be it <laughs> yeah lack of ravagers here is gonna be a real pain but we'll make do at least we're actually doing damage again which is mildly amazing to be honest Not get the okay. map. I'm done. I'm so good. has anything new? No, you don't have anything new. I don't even know why I came over here, oh, do you? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, I know I have to kill the fawn. I promised. Alright, that's the way back. This just loops around, it looks like. Flan are headed in that direction. Let's go. Yeah, Flanberg still isn't what we want, but it's doing the job. really want another Ravager. That's just how I play these games. Oh, we got a mini flan. I saw the crystal go up. Oh, and a flambin arrow. This might be exactly what we needed. Let's switch. Um. Well, 
Flamborg, Flambanero. And customize. Yeah, there we go. Awesome. Um, what do you have for Castarium right now? Uh, I'm not going to bother with that. Um, Do a little bit more. Get raise. Chair, okay. Um Definitely take flame strike. Air siphon. Sure. Feeling good about those then. Um Okay. Forward. Got a new Ravager in our midst. I'm very excited about all this. He has almost as much hit points as we do, so that's exciting. We did well. I'm feeling really good about our group here. Yep, go get that. Okay, let's just go to town, I guess. I'm gonna try to heal, but as long as we can kill them fast, it should be alright. I don't know what the hearts mean. Does something do with the fact that they're like working in groups? Did that revitalize? I, I guess I just don't know. Yeah, it's the revitalize. Oh, it's like a regen? Looks like. I don't think that symbol existed in the other game. Maybe it did. Over already? Three stars. Boo. <laughs> Thank you, Mog. He's a weird little critter. I like stepped right out of Nautilus. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. He's like a theme park mascot. What's a theme park? Uh, 
Well, it's a place where people go to just go on rides and have fun. I guess you only have them when times are peaceful and prosperous, not like where you're from. And where do you come from, anyway? A place that doesn't have much in the way of fun or civilization. That's where I'm from. <laughs> kind of reminds me of Vanille and Fang. Yeah. Come to think of it, it's a lot like them. Really? How so? They were born on Grand Pulse, just like you. Back then, on Cocoon, that was really unusual. Huh. We have things in common. Well, I'll make sure to introduce them to you. One of these days. Realistically, that's not going to happen, Snow. I bet Noel's not even in the third game. Okay, we've got two artifacts. We also have... Uh, we have... Um, we know where two more are. And I thought there were only three gates this there. No, there's four. You're, no, you're right. Fine. Let's take this one and then we'll come back and grab that other piece. I'm going to have to throw Mog to do that. Lamb and arrow first for sure. Snow just does not care who we say to target, apparently. Which is a shame, that just means he's really good at getting in our way. Which is not what we need. That Flambonero, on the other hand, is being really useful, so I'm glad we got him and upgraded him. I mean, this is clearly not even his element, because he's fire and they're all fire, but proven pretty useful. I need to take a whole episode and just we go and this. mog throw. We can't afford to fail if we don't find a way to defeat that flan. Hey, don't get too wound up now. People start to make mistakes when they stress out too much. If you know what I mean. Yeah, maybe you're right. Is Snow just gonna stay in okay, 300? Or is he coming with us? If you wanna try? Be my guest. What do you mean? For every road, there's a different gate. If you try to use a gate that's meant for someone else, well, <laughs> see. Does this mean Snow can't come with us? Yep, he stays. Uh, guess I drew the short straw. And don't you do anything foolish behind our backs, like trying to take on giant Flan single-handed? Yeah, you behave yourself, or else. You got it. I'm serious, Snow. I'll be good. <laughs> and back to business. <laughs> we still got a tattoo? Okay. Um just a second, let me check see what time is. We're at 40 minutes, so we're gonna call it. Um, we'll just do one long episode. Next time, I will uh, go ahead and uh, do some collection. I don't know what that's going to look like. I might just chop it all up, edit it down, but uh, we'll do that next. Thanks so much for watching. Once again, I'm Matthew Marco of normalmapping.com. Come back next time for more Final Fantasy 13 2. Thanks.